Jesus. So today I'm going to give you a little tour of our chicken coop. Um, it's made out of recycled wooden pallets and just some bits and pieces we had around our property. Um, it, at the moment it needs um, some furniture oil or something just to um, protect it from the weather a bit more so that's a job on our to-do list. As you can see it's up on um, stilts or legs. This is just to keep it off the ground and provides a little bit more shelter for the chickens when they're inside their chicken run and a place to keep some of their food nice and dry and away from birds. So let's have a look inside. We have a big door on the front. This allows for easy access for cleaning and just to check on the chickens in general. This is inside our chicken coop. Now what I usually do to clean is I just stick a um, wheelbarrow down here and to just scrape out all the bedding and muck into the wheelbarrow and put it into our compost heap. So inside you can see it's quite comfy. We've got um, some natural perches they like to perch on. You've got the nesting boxes at the back which we'll have a look at soon and we have some ventilation windows because it gets quite hot in here um, throughout the summer okay this is how our chickens get in and out um, the chicken boardwalk just found some old stumps lying around some old bits of wood <coughs> and we made a run up here makes it easy for them to climb up and they pop in this door here. We do have um, a door to enclose them in the coop just in case um, we need to keep them in for whatever reason that works on a pulley system. So the coop was designed so that we can um, collect the eggs from outside the run and do this by lifting up one of these doors. We can latch it up here on this hook if we want to. We've got a lot of eggs to collect. And then we can reach in and grab an egg. We collect water in this big barrel. Gravity feeds down into this tube and then we have these little nipples that um, give the chicken a drink. They learn to use that pretty quickly. And then any excess drips or anything from the system gets collected in here um, for those that just want to drink out of a vessel like this. You can see a little bee there. Some water. They give our chickens um, just table scraps and they can free range on our property and get grass and bugs and we also give them some layer pellets. Um, typically we will just throw a handful on the ground but we can also have this system um, so we can feed them from outside the coop. So what we do is we'll take off this lid. And we'll pour the feed down. Put the lid back on to keep the rain out and other critters. And it goes down the chute into this feeder, which is just made out of PVC piping with the tops cut out. So it keeps nice and dry in there. about 
12 meters by 12 meters and um, we have buried the fencing down underground to deter predators digging underneath so far so good so in the chook run I grow things like lavender and wormwood because I've read that these help deter um, mites and other pests um, away from your chickens I also break some of this up and put it into the chicken coop um, to help it smell nice and hopefully deter these mites and things for them as well all in all I think my chickens are pretty happy I mean check out their view